Hi guys, gals. I wanted to talk with you about Satan Dev Satan forward slash devils are my pets. I don't love the pet. So I suppose you could say it's a funny title. It's that some people some people might think that you know you shouldn't really mess around with the devil at all and it's true. We shouldn't really mess around with the devil and I don't really mess around with it with it at all. I just keep it and him at a distance. But I don't I don't obey it. I don't obey it. You know, that's what the devil wants us to do is to serve him and in that it will destroy and kill our lives. But the the devil can't actually control my life because I know the truth and the Bible says the truth shall set you free so when you know the truth you know how to control the devil and the devil can never control me or no no Christians no Christians for that matter if they know the truth without fearing the devil if they don't fear that if they fear the de if they fear the devil then, then the devil can control them as a pet but if you don't fear if you don't fear the devil and fear and fear and fear God and Jesus, then you have control of the devil. But saying that, you know, you we can't go around and say we're invincible, because if 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 for example, you got twenty people in a room, and 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 fifteen of them were demonically possessed, and only five of them were Christians. Obviously, if 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 fifteen of them don't understand God, and only five of them do. And only five of them do the devil would, would quickly think you know we can take these christians on we can kill them and that's what the devil will do because they they know their their power if they if there's more people in in the room that are that are that are, i've got that i've got if they, if there's more people in the room that's 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 more that's more that's not that's not that don't believe in god or that don't that don't um that don't that don't that don't like what's the word that that don't that that fear the devil and if they get demonically possessed or 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 if they or if they or if they obey obey the devil then they can they can they can harm five other Christians if it's fifteen people people that are demonically possessed. Yeah, but you know the devil can't really touch me at all, and I wouldn't re and I don't I don't really mess around with the demonic at all. I'm a Christian. I'm a spirit filled Christian. I'm a born again spirit filled Christian, and I do believe that Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior, my personal Lord and Savior, and I believe that with my whole heart, and I confess it anyway. So that's part of the Bible when you confess it in your uh, confess it out of your mouth, out of your mouth, like the Bible says. So, so what it is is that if if the devil tries to stop stop me stop me from doing things, I just confuse him and say, you know, all right, devil, I will destroy, it. I will destroy it soon. Just let me work, let me just work on it, devil. That's what I would say to the devil if he tries to try to stop me in my path i would just say i will i will destroy it i will kill it i will kill that person i will destroy that that circumstance i will i will annihilate it i will serve you i will serve you devil but in actual fact I, in my heart of hearts i won't do it because i know i'm i know the truth and, it, and like the bible says like i said in one like i said in another video the truth will set you free and perfect love, like the Bible says, cast, 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 cast out all fears. So I know I've confessed that, and I know I've just confessed that I will, I was, I will serve the devil, but it won't happen because I, will, it won't. The devil, the devil won't approach him. I won't approach him because I know the, because I know the truth, and I can talk about him, and the, and the devil won't understand it, because. Cause he won't, cause he's he's he, he hasn't got wisdom. The devil hasn't got wisdom, so the 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 mere fact that 
the myth, the, the, th the thing as well, the thing as well is the devil. The devil doesn't doesn't fear God, and the mere fact somebody doesn't fear God means that you're stupid. And if you're if you're if you're stupid, that means you won't have any wisdom. So if you fear God, that means that the Bible. If you fear God, that means the, the Bible says you, that's the beginning of wisdom. And uh, for example, I said it in one of my other videos. <clears throat> The devil doesn't really know what we're doing. He doesn't really understand what we, what human beings are doing. He can only un, he can only he can only do do things. He can only wreck things. He can only wreck things to stop us from doing things because he because he wants us to be in hell. He wants to kill us and make make sure that we go to hell. But God wants eternity. Want, wants us in heaven. Wants eternity. Um, as of the third of third of third of September, twenty seventeen. I became fearless, fearless of hum fearless of human beings and the devil. I fear nothing apart from certain things, but I don't fear people. I only fear God and Jesus. But I don't, I don't. I'm not frightened of the devil. I could, I could walk in, walk in a field completely on my own and not, not be, af not be afraid at night times, pitch black. But if, if I, if I, if I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that if I know. Somebody's going to attack me, but even if I did, I would just shout out and just cry out Jesus, and they will run away. But but you know I don't I don't I don't I don't go around testing I don't go around testing God because the Bible says we shouldn't really we shouldn't really go around testing God. We should only bring, we should only we should we should only use God and use God's name in vain when we when we're struggling with something or when we when we when we are under attack. That's the only time we should use God. God's name in vain, well, it's, which is not in vain, you're using God for something. But, you know, the Bible does say, you know, test, t the only thing you can test God in is, is in your tithing, tithings and offerings. That's the only thing you can test God in. So, so, yeah. What can I say? So apart from everything else, we shouldn't really test God. So and I can also show you what how, how I can show you how God infects. Sorry, I can show you how the devil infects things. I can I can control the devil to 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 slow down a computer to slow down a computer. I can tell tell it and the devil and Satan to control a computer on 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 making it run slowly, which is what I. Which is what I, which I, which is what I, which which is what I've done. Which I, I haven't done it, but I, but I managed to stop him, and it, Satan, I stopped it, from from. From 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 like slowing my from from I stopped it from slowing my upload of of my videos that I upload online. So yeah. That's really all I have to say in this video so let me just pray before i go so i love you guys man i have to admit that man i love you guys for watching my videos so um yeah so let's pray um heavenly father thank you for your grace and mercy you put upon us from past present and future heavenly father protect us O oh god let us know the devil's schemes let us understand the devil's schemes let us let it let us not go away O oh god deceived let us not go away and leave this video. Leave, leave, and go about our, go about our daily task without forgetting what's been heard. Oh God, help us to apply it to our lives in Jesus' name. As the devil will come around and deceive us, and waiting, waiting for for waiting, waiting and praying, on, praying and seeking whom he may devour. Oh God, I pray grace and mercy. We'll be sorry. We'll be upon that situation, O oh God. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ on the situation. I pray heal the situation, O oh God. I pray anointing fall upon that situation, Father. I pray restore our bodies, O oh God, to its original form. Heal us, O oh God. In Jesus' name, I plead the blood of Jesus Christ on the situation. I pray anointing fall upon that situation. I pray grace and mercy be upon that situation. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ on the situation. I pray anointing fall upon that situation. I pray these things all in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you all. Love you lots. Bye for now.